One morning, Edward and Nia were watching at the ships and the sailing boats, and they could also see the sea. They look a beautiful ocean. I like the boat to see the sail. It was the most beautiful sight ever seen. Nia thinking calmly. You know it worked. Back in Africa, I could see the sailboats and the ocean and the sea. Since where I got here. Oh Nia, I'm very proud to do it. But right now, we had uh, so much work to do. We can see more later. Soon, Edward and Nia were shunting cars. She knew he was clever, but she is really useful. Nia sometimes had us solving problems and helping out too. Now, Edward and Nia were very good friends. Suddenly, there is an emergency happen. That's the emergency. I had to spoke to the harbor master. Nia's driver returned with the bad news. There's a man. He had broke his ankle. He needs to get to the hospital right away. Come on. So Nia puffed away fast as she could. Harold was there. He had to carry to the man to the hospital. But unfortunately, he instead, they landed to the harbor. So they had to take a ride with Nia to the hospital. I will take it there, sir. So Nia was rushing down the tracks. She never gave up. Then, they take the man to the bus, and they are ready for taking to the hospital. Nia was very happy. Clever and smart, thanks to Nia. That evening, they continues watching at the sea. Nia's driver saw something on the letter on the floor. He picked it up. He opened up a envelope and said, Well done, Nia. You are so clever you are. Nia felt very happy. She knew he was clever, but never felt her happy. Now on, they had to continue watching at the sea. That was a good story, don't you?